So guys, I am back with another Lords of the Fallen video and today guys, I'm going to showcase to you how you can cheese a boss by, who goes by the name of the Sacred Resonance of Tenacity who is a pretty hard boss by the way but you will cheese him to the point of him not being able to hit you well, he can hit you but you will kill him you will take him down without actually laying any damage on him whatsoever it is so easy, this will be patched out of the game so if you are struggling with this boss, use it while you can uh, but hey do what you gotta do how's it going guys my name is dpj and if you do enjoy the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more laws of the fallen be sure to subscribe okay so taking out this boss he rewards you the sacred resonance hammer now this is an absolute beast from what i've seen of it i mean i ain't quite got the strength requirement for it yet but the videos i have seen this thing is truly op and it's definitely one you want to get it's a grand hammer man oh man this thing's a beast and because you can cheese this boss you get it for completely free with no work whatsoever also guys you will also be able to get this thing right here which is called the Deer's hardiness a shout source which allows you to summon the hardiness of a deer within yourself increasing your defense and resistances but the thing this needs is it needs you to have the pilgrim's perch key now that is purchased from that npc right there that vendor and we are at the very first um well one of the first vestiges you'll come to after you beat um Paeta. The, well is it the first or second boss the bird with the massive sword who actually becomes a uh, vendor for you right here guys there she is but hey come to this dude right here and purchase the pilgrim's perch key if you haven't already again there's a room within this uh this boss battle where you can actually open that room and get this amazing thing so yes now it will cost you 9500 viga i bought it ages ago i've got it right here uh somewhere let's have a quick look there it is right there so yeah i've already got it so definitely purchased this already if you haven't uh, got the viga yet you can always go back to that spot that boss battle it doesn't really matter now what i will say is as well guys i'll show you the exact location of where this boss can be found if you haven't beat him yet but you want to do this cheese and get those rewards before it's patched that's cool but for the people who are watching this video as of right now because they want this cheese and they are struggling this is what you gotta do so start the boss fight it's this simple once you start to attack him you will notice he's shielded via that umbral realm so if you're in the standard realm you raise your shield you'll see that he's being shielded you need to take down that shield simple as that guys so do what you gotta do once you do this you will notice again when you try to attack him he's still shielded uh, that is because there's a shield within that center cage the shield is also shielding all the other enemies within this vicinity within this boss arena so you need to take that out too the best way to do this is guys to take well to try and kite all these enemies out of this center cage because there's quite a few in there and if you try and go in there with them all attacking you and try and take out this umbral shield it's it's gonna hurt it's probably gonna result in your death so try and kite them out unless you're brave like me and then just do what you gotta do and take out this umbral shield the shield that's basically shielding all these enemies once you do this guys you can now lay damage down on all these ads as well as the main boss here so now what you gotta do guys is and this is the easiest part all you have to do is kite the boss up these stairs once you climb up these stairs you jump off he will quickly follow you he will jump down and you'll see a massive chunk of his health will come off do this five or six times by rotating around the room going back up these steps jumping back down as you can see me doing on the screen now and eventually guys this boss will die this will kill him and it will reward you that amazing hammer so yeah do what you gotta do like i said this is a clear cheese this is not meant to be in the game this is something they will definitely patch out of the game so use this while you can especially if you're struggling or if you ain't at this this boss yet i'll show you how to get to it in a quick second but hey it's a great cheese it rewards you great weapon and it also gives you this amazing thing too um the ideas what's it called again now let's have a look the ideas hardness great great thing you want this you definitely want this guys okay so if you don't know where this boss battle is you want to walk to uh let's have a look where are we we want to go to this one here it's the vestige of blind agatha this is the the, the farming spot this is the farming vestige this is where the afk farm the afk viga farm takes place sorry as well as a few other farms if you don't know where this is you will eventually come to this 
after you take it out, uh, the Scourge Sister of Delif. After you take her out, this is probably the next one in line you'll come to. But hey, from here, guys, from again, the Vestige of Blind Agatha, you want to come this way. Now, this can be a little tricky. Uh, there's a few ads in the way here, which you may have to take out. Um, let's quickly put on another weapon here, just in case I do have to start swinging. Let's put on you there. But you should be okay if you're quick, like me. Okay, so come through this door. I just want to peg it. You want to peg it straight down here. The only thing that does really does my head in is the, the crossbow dudes. Those think people are so overpowered. They need looking into. So here guys, take a sharp left. Be careful. Dodge because he's gonna drop one. Dodge again, dodge again. I got hit up the arse, but don't worry about it. Here guys, you want to enter the umbral realm. What I'll do is I jump straight off. Just jump straight off. Enter that umbral realm. You'll knock all these guys off too. And you just want to run across here. That's what I'll do. Simple, it's just easier. It's just easier. And come around this way. Come around this corner. And we're going to go out of this door here. But you want to take a sharp left. There's a guy right behind there. You see the guy on the ledge there. If you try and walk out and kick him off, the guy comes up behind you and tries to knock you off. So a quick, quick left like that. As a crossbow dude here. So be careful. Run past him. And go through here. Use the health. There we go. Now on your left hand side, guys, if you have the seeds, there will be an anchor between realms. So make sure you activate this if you can. This is a great, well, some people who are doing this boss will have this checkpoint unlocked already. But yeah. So do what you got to do, guys. And from here, come up this ladder behind you. And there's two ads up here, but you can just run straight past them. It's pretty easy. So we're just going to run around here. And just like this, I'm just going to dodge past them just like that and there we go now the boss battle the boss room will be here on your left hand side this is the boss room simple as this so once you're in here this is what you got to do well, you know what you got to do well now if you've got the pilgrim's perch key if you come up these steps this is the, these are the steps we kite the boss off to his death on your right hand side here there is a door you need again you need the pilgrim's perch key to open this and within that chest guys you get the idea's hardiness it really is that simple again when you've defeated this boss you've got that loot you've now also got another pathway to explore and find more things simple as that and there we have it guys guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one